Hello everybody, Ninja here. A uh, little video here is going to show you how to fix um, if you're getting an error of uh, 0xc00001.35 uh, um, and this is mainly after if you did an update with Windows 11. I think 10 has it too. Uh, Microsoft did release uh, major patches for vulnerabilities so um, if you try to run certain applications, you get this error. Even if you try to install or reinstall the application you're having a problem with. Um, I had to help a friend fix this problem, so hopefully the same method will fix your problem if you're having the same error. Um, but it comes after Microsoft doing their, their updates. Um, again, mainly for Windows 11 is what I'm seeing it affect people with. So... Um, the update that did go through was the uh, KB5013943. Um, and what it does, it apparently breaks the uh, .NET uh, framework stuff. So um, how you, you can actually fix this is if you go to your start and then just type in control panel, um, go to programs and features, Try not to go too fast. Um, and then when you get to control panel, just go to turn Windows features on or off. Um, then you'll get this window here. Just make sure you have these box, boxes checked. Um, you would just hit OK. Oh, sorry, I'm like really tired. Um, once you do that, uh, you might have to restart your machine, uh, see if the issue is fixed. If so, great. Um, uh, if not, you might have to actually look for those uh, and like uninstall uh, those uh, and then reinstall them. Uh, another way to do it is uh, if you don't want to go through the command uh, control panel, you can do command prompt, uh, which is just go and start, type in CMD, just right click, or if you go down here, uh, you can hit run as administrator, you can hit yes, and then you will get a box. Uh, and then you would just type in uh, uh, three commands. I won't do all three of them. I'll just show you one of them. This is one of them. Um, I'll show you uh, in the, on the screen here in a bit you know, what the commands are. I'm just not going to run them on my machine because I'm not having a problem with any of it. So, um, But you would want to run this command, hit enter, wait for it to do its thing. And there's another command, hit enter. Wait for it to do its thing. Run a third command. Enter. Wait for it to do its thing. If it fixes your issue, great. If not, again, you might have to reinstall the .NET stuff, um, which would be the ones I was showing about uh, showing you earlier. Uh, which would you just go to? You know, I can always post. I'll, I'll link the where to get them in the description for you. Um, but quick little video, hopefully, um, and hopefully it should help you out. All right, guys, enjoy. See ya.